Are you confused yet? <laughs> yeah, I think I was too when I wrote that. All right, okay. Does anybody here remember when you were a little kid and you liked to play pretend? Yeah, okay. Does anybody still like to play pretend sometimes? I do, it's fun, okay. So what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna ask you to pretend that I am a little kid. Okay, so forget about, uh, just pretend that you don't see all this fuzzy white stuff all over my face. <laughs> That's what you can look forward to when you get older. Well, you guys, not you girls, hopefully, yeah. Anyway, so this is a poem that I wrote about something that happened when I was a kid. And it's called, A Whole Goal Hole. A Whole Goal Hole. Forehead beating, red rusted shovel in hand, he slowly and methodically dug a hole under the blazing Midwestern sun. A whole hole, right in our backyard. Well, that was amazing enough, until the wheelbarrow came. Careful measures of gravel and water mixed together to form a, a sticky paste. It was kind of like cold, lumpy, gray oatmeal. Uh, well, I watched in awe. His veins strained as he lifted and poured the thick mixture. It filled the whole hole, which his arms and his back, now glistening from the August heat, had created. He collapsed and wiped the sweat from his neck creating yellow-brown stains on his once-white t-shirt. I sipped grape-flavored Kool-Aid from a smiley-faced mug and marveled at the strength of his sun-reddened arms. Suddenly, he stood, motioned me to his side, and with gritted teeth and dripping brows, we raised the towering mast upon which was mounted my first goal in life. It stretched upward toward heaven and almost down to China. Thank you. <laughs>